click to share on WhatsApp, opens in new window, click to share on Facebook, opens in new window, click to share on Twitter, opens in new window. It's never wise to read too much into a club's preseason form, but Liverpool's excellent win over Bayern Munich in the semi-final of the Audi Cup on Tuesday has certainly given fantasy football fans plenty to think about. Jurgen Klopp's side thrashed the German Giants 3-0, with a fully fit Sadio Main particularly impressing in the Reds' forward line. Main is still recovering from the knee ligament injury that curtailed his last campaign, but his performance in Munich showed a return of the sharpness, speed and skill that the Anfield faithful fell in love with last season. New boy Mohamed Salah also impressed scoring yet another goal during pre-season, while the likes of Alberto Moreno and Trent Alexander-Arnold showed encouraging signs ahead of the new season. With Friday's draw for the Champions League playoff stage looking, we took a good look at five talking points fantasy football managers might want to consider. 1. Alberto Moreno, yes, really was thoroughly excellent ask any Liverpool fan which player has consistently frustrated them over the last couple of seasons, and they'll probably tell you it's been this guy. Moreno started ahead of new boy Andrew Robertson against Bayern and produced an all-round stellar performance against the Bundesliga winners. Defensively, he was sound, getting the best of Thomas Muller on the left flank time and time again, while he was equally as thrilling going forward. In fact, it was Moreno's drilled cross that led to Mohamed Salah's strike in the first half. But has he done enough to remain at Anfield this season? 2. Philippe Cochu continues to impress in the middle One of the most popular players on Dream Team last season continues to impress. And if he remains at Liverpool this season, Barcelona want him, Paris Saint-Germain want him. Then Klopp will do well to play him in the classic number 10 role. He's been simply awesome there throughout pre-season. Another man who's had a good summer is Alexander-Arnold. The youngster once again got his chance in Klopp's starting lineup, playing the majority of the match at right back. It doesn't get much bigger than going up against the experienced Frank Ribey, and the 18-year-old showed he was no slouch Nathaniel Klein will have some competition this season. The England forward scored Liverpool's third goal on the night and his first of pre-season with a wonderful chip over the onrushing Sven Ulrich, but limped off with a thigh injury only moments after. He may still have that killer instinct, but we reckon he's one to avoid on Dream Team this season. These two look very tasty together. Bayern could do little to prevent the sheer excellence of Main and Salah, who played together for the first time on Tuesday night. Main grabbed Liverpool's first after only seven minutes, and was pivotal in the build-up for their second, combining well with Moreno for Salah to head home. If Main can stay fit this season, he could easily become Liverpool's key figure as they compete on multiple fronts, including the Champions League. Team names have become almost as important as picking winning sides in recent years. With the punnier the better the general perspective. So whether it's Shiru Sanderstorm, Neville Wears Prado or Teenage Mutant Ninja Shkirtle, check out our foolproof list to help you decide. While we'd all like to be able to pick a team of superstars, that £50 million budget means you also need to have an eye for a cheeky bargain. This season there are quite a few intriguing options available, with Vincent Company, £3.5 million and Andu Herrera, £3.0 million, both at high-catching prices. In attack, West Ham new boy and Manchester United favourite Javier Hernandez is £3.5 million which seems like pennies for guaranteed goals, like what you see? Keep up to date with our Fantasy Football Live blog and sign up to play Dream Team below.